in order to rearrange the VF squared equals VI squared plus 2AD equation uh, for VF, if we were trying to isolate VF, all we do is take the square root of both sides, and when we do that, VF equals square root of VI squared plus 2AD. All that's going to be underneath the square root. To solve for VI, what we're going to do is subtract 2AD from both sides, minus 2AD, and we end up getting VF squared minus 2AD equals VI squared. Take the square root of both sides and you end up getting VI equals square root of VF squared minus 2AD. All that once again underneath the square root. And then we go over here, we want to solve for A. What we're going to do is subtract VI squared from both sides. So we end up getting VF squared minus VI squared equals 2AD. And then we want to divide everything we don't need, 2D out 2D. 2D, 2D, we get A equals VF squared minus VI squared over 2D. And then lastly, if we want to rearrange that equation for D, it's practically the same thing, minus VI squared minus VI squared, and we end up getting VF squared minus VI squared equals 2AD. Divide out the 2A this time, 2A, and we end up getting D equals VF squared minus VI squared over 2A. So it's that one, this one, this one, and lastly, this one.